on the 12th of March uh, in our uh, online masterclass uh, about becoming a spiritual warrior uh, and healing the wounds uh, uh, in our life, um, we are going to uh, work uh, with uh, um, a shamanic uh, uh, Japanese uh, uh, art of repairing uh, uh, our wounds, uh, which is the art of Kintsugi, which is not only shamanic, but it comes from, uh, um, from the art field. Um, and applied to our wounds, uh, we, we know that always our mind uh, um, tries to search uh, a moral lesson when something happens. And it's also trying to say to itself, uh, oh, that happened and uh, uh, it helped me to learn something. So just like uh, to justify a uh, happening. So, but the soul uh, has an aesthetic attitude compared to the mind. So the so our soul uh, is trying always to contemplate the event, the happening, uh, as a work of art in itself. So bringing out the emotions uh, of uh, uh, what is happening, and um, emotions is the tool, the, the soul's tool, so to dissolve the cage of the mental uh, uh, judgment. Um, also because this is the purpose of the soul, to try to dissolve uh, the ego, to try to dissolve uh, uh, the, the I, uh, in a ritual of uh, death and rebirth, so which is also a rite of passage, which is very much shamanic, uh, um, where nothing uh, is the same uh, as before uh, and, uh, and, and consciousness uh, has the opportunity to uh, expand because uh, originally the shaman was a psychopomp so it was the one taking uh, um, beyond the threshold uh, uh, people and souls that, uh, that uh, um, were about to die, that had died and helping them to go towards the light. Then afterwards it became uh, uh, the role of the shaman, the, the, the function of the healer. So the art of the kintsugi uh, is very simple because it's natural, but of course it's not easy. It's not easy to heal a wound, to heal a pain, a grief. Uh, we need, of course, to be guided and initiated into this art. Um, and then when it happens, our own life uh, uh, takes another flavor, another uh, uh, new depth. Um, so the Kintsugi uh, is the art of repairing the broken uh, uh, objects uh, with the gold. No? So the art of fixing, uh, um, the art of uh, treasuring our wounds, if we translate that to a symbolical meaning. Um, repairing them with uh, uh, the gold of pure ecstatic experience. Um, it means that we need to see our wounds uh, with the eyes of the soul, uh, um, which is welcoming uh, all these wounds, all these pains. Uh, um, and they uh, and our soul uh, um, heals uh, these wounds with the gold of death, of rebirth and freedom. So learning this art uh, means uh, um, gaining uh, a learning process and gaining a huge transformation, a big uh, uh, change. Instead of trying to put a patch, instead of trying to covering, uh, to cover the, our wounds, instead of just saying uh, like we norm what we normally say, um, uh, the time will heal, just uh, focus on the positive aspect, uh, which are uh, the common sentences uh, that we uh, we hear but by doing that we are ignoring this wound we are ignoring something uh, uh, in which we need to go through because that is the only way to um, to fix literally something to repair something by going inside this uh, uh, the, the dark night, as we would say. Um, so the Kintsugi is a metaphor to, that we need to apply to life. Uh, 
because when we look backwards uh, and we look at our eyes and we feel and we see that we uh, we make mistakes that we have missed some opportunities uh, that we have taken uh, wrong turns uh, um with um, we should actually be able to put together all these pieces in our life all these uh, broken pieces uh in uh, of, of our history with gold and transforming our mistakes from the fractures from the cracks from uh, from which we we pour out and we disperse power because we lose energy when when something inside ourselves uh, uh, has been broken uh, and we can embellish uh, this broken part this broken happening in our life so this is of course a beautiful wabi-sabi practice uh, um, that plays together the japanese concept of uh, uh, wabi which is the principle of uh, fragility imperfection uh, resilience uh, and then the sabi principles uh, which are connected with the passage of time um, and uh, it allows us to understand that nothing is ever truly broken or lost. So the scar is simply a door um, through which uh, we can allow the light to enter. Um, and uh, we just need to master this heart of uh, um, using uh, uh, the gold element instead of hiding uh, our wound or hiding ourselves into the darkness. Um, and the, the art of Kintsugi also teaches us to appreciate the things uh, uh, that we, uh, we have in our life uh, um, and uh, also on a daily basis to try to repair objects in general in our life instead of being uh, uh, in a consumistic society where some, when something is broken, when an object is broken and we simply throw it away um, and we buy a new one. Um, so reduce and also in general reducing the amount and the quantity of things that we have in our life because we have a lot we have uh, we accumulate uh, so many things uh, in uh, in our houses uh, in our life in general uh, and um, sometimes it's hard to uh, also to have a clarity of vision of inner vision when we have uh, uh, too many things or also too many people around our life maybe too many people that are uh, absorbing our energy. Uh, so the Kintsugi teaches us to transform the perception of our weaknesses uh, and fragilities, uh, uh, allowing us to appreciate them uh, as a sign of beauty and also as another opportunity, as another chance to shine back again. Um, Especially because we we are living in a, in an age where anxiety and stress uh, are uh, on the rise are already in a in a huge quantity uh, in a huge amount around us. So we carry uh, around a lot of wounds, uh, and um, it's not a problem to to have an injury. It's not a problem to in uh, to injure ourselves uh, if we are then able to repair our wounds with gold. So this is what we are going to see in our master class. Uh, just briefly speaking about the three kind, the three types of wounds, uh, three types of uh, um, repair that we can do in our uh, in our wounds in the in the kintsugi which is one uh, is called hibi, which is basically repairing the, fra the fracture. So an object is repairing uh, by putting together two pieces that uh, uh, fit perfectly. So it's like an object is broken into pieces and they can go together in a perfect way. So um, there is a very small quantity of, of gold that is needed. Then we have kakenok in sugirei which is uh, where uh, uh, the objects don't, don't, don't fit together anymore. And so, for example, one, one piece has been broken, has been lost. Uh, and uh, in that case, uh, we need to compensate that missing part with a lot of gold. 
So we need uh, to uh, substitute that missing part with a lot of gold. And then we have uh, uh, the third one, which is the yobitsugi, yobitsugi, which is like a patchwork, a mosaic. It means uh, that we can take pieces of other uh, uh, broken objects and place them together. And that's also uh, a very, it would also be a very beautiful uh, work of art because we are creating uh, something unique. So in our masterclass, we are going to use one of these uh, uh, Kintsugi types to repair one uh, uh, of your wounds, um, to uh, work... Uh, uh, the, the, the wounds that we can speak about uh, uh, are those where we uh, have negative judgment or we have anger uh, or we have a lack of something, something or someone uh, uh, are missing, uh, uh, we have fear, we have insecurity in general, and for each of them there is a specific shamanic work that can be done. Uh, so we are going to uh, take uh, um, one of them and uh, uh, work to try to uh, heal uh, uh, once for all uh, uh, a symbolical wound, uh, uh, maybe the biggest one that you can choose uh, uh, as a symbol of all of them. So that then once the process has started, uh, uh, it's going also to act uh, on in representation of all the other wounds uh, uh, that you can have in your life. So you just, it's a free masterclass uh, on the 12th of March, 6 p.m. UK time. Um, on the website uh, um, www.schoolofshamanism.co.uk you can find the link to sign up it will be uh, it will be done in zoom via zoom so you will receive the uh, the booking link and um, i'm looking forward to uh, to see many of you online with the real uh, commitment of uh, working and feeling like an artist uh, of your soul.